Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been a while where I've just sat down and talked to you guys about our favorite things, which is makeup, skincare. And since July has come to an end, so I decided to talk about my July favorites. All right, so the first product that I have been loving is this Color Bar On The Go Makeup Remover Wipes. So you get 10 wipes in this for rupees 95 and this one is so travel friendly. Now that I traveled in July, guys. Yeah, but I did travel earlier this year in the month of March and this was really helpful in taking off my makeup. But these come handy if I'm having very heavy makeup. So when I film my makeup tutorials, a lot of times I reach out to this and I actually don't use the entire uh, white piece. I Sometimes I don't require that. So I just cut it into half and I just use it on my eyes and save the rest. So sometimes you need very little and you can use this trick for it because you get a whole big wipe. Sometimes you don't use the entire wipe. So you can just cut it and save the rest. As compared to Neutrogena, these are much cheaper and much affordable alternative. And I'm the kind of person who does like packaging, so I do love the color, but I'm recommending it in this video because it performed well, okay? <laughs> okay, second product is eyelashes. These are by Bronson Professional. These are in the number 58. Now, if you have watched my tutorials previously, there were a few videos where I've used eyelashes. And the reason for that is, I'm not a very big fan of those big lashes. Uh, even in my wedding, I actually got Huda Beauty Samantha lashes, which are so raved, so loved, but I felt they were looking so huge on my eyes and so natural. I'm always looking for lashes which are very natural looking and I love that the band here is very thin. The lashes are subtle and natural and it just gives you that nice lift that you want, still not exaggerated. And that is what I absolutely love about this. The packaging, of course, these eyes sort of represent Huda Beauty. I don't know why okay so when i tried them for the first time i wasn't sure if they would look great uh but i did wear them in my pani pani makeup so you can check out the video here and they looked very natural they did give that lift but not too exaggerated and not scary okay so the next product is a makeup product it is a concealer by pack and it's called take the cover concealer it's in the shade classic beige and i got this online this shade really matches me to the dot it is warm toned it has a little bit of orange undertones as well and it sets very quick under the eye of course you have to use powder to set it but i really like the coverage it gives it's very natural looking like it's not going to give you a lot of highlight but it still conceals that is the most important thing and it really hides the discoloration so it's very easy to blend doesn't crease it's very affordable as well so you can try this concealer especially if you come under the category of wheatish wheatish to dusky it is quite a class to find out good concealers of course there are a lot of concealers today in the market but i feel finding out affordable options and good options is still a struggle so this is one i can definitely recommend by pack so yeah absolutely love this one all right so the fourth product that i absolutely loved during july and otherwise especially i gravitated towards this one whenever monsoon arrives and this is such a savior so it's the lotus safe sun sunscreen i've been using this sunscreen from quite a while and there's a very old video on my channel i talked about this sunscreen even then and see today also i'm using this has to be good this is a matte formulation first of all it sets on your skin really well it doesn't give you any coverage okay it's a matte gel it is transparent so this is spf 50 it provides a protection for a longer time and uh, you can definitely try using this one most of us don't wear sunscreen because we find the sunscreen to be too heavy on our skin you know either it's giving you a white cast this will not do that because it's a gel formulation or it's getting too oily it makes you sweat this is again not going to do that because it's a gel formulation so and this is so loved actually i mean i'm not the only person it's not something like a secret discovery it's really really loved i don't actually use this one in winters because i have dry skin and this dries my skin out so you can use this if your skin feels oily or if it feels oily during the monsoon season like me if you have combination skin i have dry skin but i do switch up my products a little bit during monsoon and it does really help and this is one of the products so i've already finished this one this one was a big one you can see how much i get into the product <laughs> i just recently finished this one it's a bigger one and i do have a new one to be used all right so the last product is this one now what is this so this is by the brand faces and uh, this is basically a nail paint remover so what you do you open it like this and you put your finger and you sort of swirl it around and when you take your finger out it actually gets rid of your nail polish um i do have a video i link it here it's a short video i've used the color bar one in that one so it's not about this particular brand but i like this one as well so using a dip nail paint remover 
changes your life it just makes your life so much easier i remember back in the day i used to take my cotton dip that nail polish remover keep on rubbing it you know and then this one and then this one by the time i start on my other hand the nail polish remover has sort of dried out this is super convenient uh, especially when you have those nail polishes which are very tough to remove uh, the glitter ones or if you apply top coats this is going to work for you you can try this one or you can try the one by color bar actually the color bar one is a little bit better honestly i mean there's a lot just I, I just feel it used to take off uh, the nail polish even quicker like you know maybe like five seconds quicker yeah but this is also really good so it's about this concept that i'm talking about this one is there there's another there's another brand that i used um kiss beauty swiss Be not not swiss beauty i have forgotten the name i'm sorry it was a very generic uh makeup brand that i came across but it was very effective and they say you can always put more nail polish remover into it and you can sort of renew it but i think that would be sort of gross because then the sponge is already dirty so i don't recommend that you can you know buy a new one yeah so but this is a great product and if you haven't used this you can give it a try because uh, it will change your life uh, just that you know your hands do feel a little dry afterwards it depends on the season so i like to moisturize but that being said this is a great one all right guys so i really hope you found this quick video informative and helpful so comment down below if you're using any of these products or if you want to use if you do like this video make sure to hit that like button show your support by hitting that like button right now and subscribe to this channel for amazing content on makeup skincare hair and fashion and you would find everything very honest and helpful on this channel so subscribe right now and by the way i do have an instagram handle and facebook page as well the links are in the description box and i'm quite active there so you have to follow me there as well and i'll see you next time Bye bye